Hey everybody, I'm Ellen here at eTrailer.com and we're going to take a look at the Rockstar Splash Guard Mud Flaps. These are a custom fit application for your vehicle and they can work for either the front or rear. Now they fit on the 2017 through the current model of the two. Uh, F-250 and the F-350 and that's for the vehicles that have uh, with or without the, the fender flares although it does not fit the 350 dually so just keep that in mind there. These are really nice mud flaps and the fact that they're just a really thick piece of material they look pretty nice once they're installed but I really like how just sturdy and thick these are I think they're really going to do a great job of deflecting any kind of rocks or anything else that might want to kick up underneath your vehicle and potentially scratch your paint on your truck or damage anything that you might be towing with you so it comes with all the hardware that you see laid out on the table we've got some brackets here to mount it to the inside of the fender on the F-250 and 350. These are reversible. It's got kind of a uh, kind of crinkle black finish to it here. You can flip it over just to the plain metal side. It's kind of up to you as far as you what, what you want. Uh, this side sort of matches a little bit more the trim plate at the bottom, but if you have it on the black side, it kind of just matches in with the rest of the mud flap and it's uh, a little less noticeable. So up to you there. Uh, the Trim plates at the bottom are also going to be an aluminum construction, just like these brackets. So shouldn't have to worry about any kind of rust or corrosion. St should stay looking nice over time. Very important for our vehicle. We don't want our mud flaps to get rusty or anything like that, so we don't have to worry about any of that. Comes with all the hardware that you need to attach this to your Ford truck. Um, might require a little bit of drilling to get it in place. One thing that I'm not uh, a big fan of with these mud flaps is that it comes with a bracket and all these holes in the bracket line up with these but this one at the very end uh, just doesn't line up with the mud flap I'm not really sure why because it should uh, so that's one thing that's a little bit annoying but you, know, you can just make a hole wherever it needs to line up to get into that mud flap uh, so you're just gonna be drilling through this material so it shouldn't be a big deal as far as what this is made out of it is a really nice composite material so it can withstand a lot of heat up to 200 degrees and still remain flexible at negative 40 degrees. So very durable rubber. And like I said, it's just really thick. Like it can almost hold its weight even with that trim plate on there. So it's just a really heavy duty mud flap, a lot heavier than, um, than pretty much any of the other ones that I've seen. Some that are maybe even as thick, but just not quite as stiff. So they should, Definitely have a, a good chance of holding down and not coming up with the wind or anything like that. You shouldn't have to worry about getting any kind of bracketry. Some other ones that are a little bit more flexible, they need like mud flap holders to make sure that they don't just fly up with the wind. I don't think you would need anything like that for these. They're just so heavy duty. As far as the size, these measure about 12 inches wide, pretty much right on, and then from the very bottom to the very top edge, it's 23 inches. There is another set of these that are exactly the same in every respect, but they're 20 inches long, so about three inches shorter. It's up to you of which one you would want. Uh, the longer length, obviously, is just gonna go further down, probably eliminates any more rocks from getting kicked up. Probably gonna be more important for um, a rear mounting application, especially if you are towing, to protect maybe your fifth wheel or your uh, bumper pull camper that you might be pulling behind you. That longer length just helps to keep those rocks from kicking up. Other than that, no difference between the two kits. You can find either one of those sizes here at eTrailer.com. Just something I wanted to point out that it is there is a little bit of variability as far as what's available for your Ford truck. Um, as far as the length that comes down below that fender wheel or wherever it's mounted looks like it's about 17 inches so you're going to have 17 inches of length going below your truck to protect it from anything getting kicked up and splattering on your vehicle or damaging it pretty much uh, that's all there really is to it Another nice thing about it is that it is covered by a limited lifetime warranty made in the USA, so you should be able to trust that these are going to last you a long time. They stand behind their product and should be pretty straightforward to get installed. That's pretty much it for our look at the Rockstar 
splash guard mud flaps. I hope this has been helpful in deciding if these are the right choice for you. We do have a lot of other accessories for your trucks and any kind of towing application here at eTrailer.com. And it's always our goal to make sure that you get the right part the first time. So I hope this helped. Thanks for watching.